Welcome to Morning Manor with Pastor Steve Mary. Today's topic, just do it. A man's gift may get room for him and bring it him before great men. Do you see a man who excel in his work? He will stand before kings. He will not stand before unknown men. Proverbs 18, 16 and 22, 29. We are all gifted and talented in one way or the other. The word opportunity is defined as a time or a set of circumstances that make it possible to do something. Now, it's quite possible to sit around and wait for the right opportunity to come. But then there are those who make their own opportunity by using their gifts. In your secular job, you will not be given a promotion unless you show what is in you because your employers are not psychic. God knows what is in you because he's the one who put it there in the first place. But he did not put it there for it to be hidden. Now with both work and church, one cannot be promoted unless they prove themselves. Jesus said when a man lights a candle, he does not light it and put it under a bushel. Let's observe the life of David. David, as you know, was just a shepherd boy. He was the youngest. In many ways, he was not regarded as his brothers. But then there came the day when David went and heard what Goliath was saying. David realized that all of them were cowards, and he was equipped to take care of Goliath. Even though his brothers had a problem, David did not shy away from letting Saul know that he was willing to face Goliath. And by proving himself on the battlefield, David rose to prominence, even that above his own brothers, because though he was the youngest, he became the commander of Saul's army. We have to make use of the gifts and talents that God has given to us. Many are blessed with various gifts in the church, but then whenever an opportunity comes, we shy away from it. Whenever we are asked to moderate the service, to read a scripture, to give an exhortation, or even to sing a song, the first word that comes out of our mouth is no. If God has called you, you have to start somewhere. Sometimes you just got to do it. There's a young man in my church by the name of Michael who has a job, but his true passion is in the culinary field. Now, instead of sitting around and murmuring that he cannot get the job that he truly wants, seeing that many menus are so monotonous, he came up with this idea that you can make a call and on the weekend, you can have your meal prepared for you according to your specifications. And thus was birthed weekend cookings. Now, since this young man started, he have been receiving calls from all over. Now, just imagine if he had sat on what he had and was complaining about what he did not have and not realizing what he did have. In life, you just got to be willing to do it. You just got to be willing to drum. You just got to be willing to do whatever it takes. Life is not going to get any easier. But thanks be to God, God has equipped you to survive this journey. Today's scripture remind us that a man's gift will make room for him. But let me hasten to say that the only way the gift will make the room is if you use the gift. The quote of the day, use your gifts to seize your opportunities. God bless you today, in Jesus' name. Please remember to like and subscribe to my page on YouTube. Your support is much appreciated. Hey, Promise keeper, light and the darkness.